Joyce Troop here at Bike Man Performance. Today we're going to show you the Sniper Wayne. Today we're introducing the Sniper Weight. One of the most adjustable weights you've ever seen. This one here is for the Polaris Snowmobile Clutch. Uh, it is mega adjustable. This is a CAD drawing of it, and you can see everywhere that weight can go. We have four magnets in the very tip, four magnets down low, four magnets just off of the heel. These do something neat that nobody else has done. And we also have four tungsten cylinders that can go in here. These tungsten cylinders are four grams each, so that's 16 grams we can add right in here. So what that does is allows us to change the center mass and the weight of this weight to anywhere in this weight so we can make this weight act like every weight out there and any weight out there and even more adjustability than the current weights that are available. So let's go over what these different things do. We can add four magnets to every hole here. If we add it to the lower hole, that's 5.6 grams we just added down here. So this way here, it's gonna bring the center mass backwards. Now, we can pull the weight out just as easy we put it in there. Uh, we can add the same four magnets or two magnets or whatever towards the tip down low. The weight out here is gonna act heavier. It's also gonna, when it comes over center, it's gonna be more effective at higher mile an hour. So it's gonna have low impact at low speeds and high impact at high speeds. By moving the center mass to the very end, this weight dynamic acts way heavier because all the weight is at the tip. It moves the center mass outward. Anytime we move the center mass outward, this weight value is worth more than a weight value back here. If we want the weight to be down low, we can put the weight down low and have that weight not have a lot of load, let it kind of rev up and then slingshot grab uh, after the horsepower is being made. That works extremely well for turbo sleds. And the weight towards the tip, we can, by having this much adjustability out here, we can change the whole dynamics of how heavy that weight acts. Even though the weight only goes to 90 grams, by having the weight stacked way out to the tip like this, we can make this weight act like a 106 gram weight just because of how, far, how much further that center mass is out from the pivot. Down this barrel, we have set screws. We have a stop set screw, and we also have insert set screws. So anytime you put a set screw in, you wanna run the set screw into the depth you want, and then bottom a set, another set screw out on it. By doing that, you have a jam effect so the set screws won't come loose. The other neat thing is that when you put the one in, you can change how deep they are in and out of that cylinder. Now, if you wanna move the weight back towards the heel, but have it high up, we can put a jam set screw, a piece of tungsten and another set screw behind it and have a heavy mass towards here. That'll get that weight to come over center faster and really load that motor soon. If we add weight low, your sled's gonna rev up more and then load heavy. Uh, if we add tungstens up high, it's gonna create a lot of low end load. The weight would come over center faster. And when the weight comes over center faster, that really loads that motor down low. So the engine with high torque, uh, naturally aspirated sleds, they like that weight to come over a little bit faster than like a turbo sled does. And if the if tungsten's more towards the heel, that weight is gonna come over center and it's gonna be more effective at, at lower speed and less effective at higher speed. So by moving this weight around, we can change the entire dynamics of this weight. So we can make it revy down low, then load, or we can make it loaded down low, then revy, or we can make it load consistently the whole way through. When you add everything in, uh, we can get this weight, you know, 90 grams. So uh, 90 grams to 58 grams, that's huge adjustability, but it's not just the weight adjustability, it's how you can change the dynamics of the center mass, because the center mass of the weight is everything, because that's where it comes over center and, and where that momentum is taking it. Uh, this does everything that our old weight did, plus 
everything that every other weight out there does that we've tested. Uh, you're going to see this weight being used by a bunch of companies out there because this is the ultimate weight. So this is the weight you need to do the ultimate tuning. So that's our sniper way. Hope you enjoyed our description of it. Uh, it does anything you want it to do. Check out this and all our cool products at bikemanperformance.com.